Those right. of us who are uh, full casters get fourth level spells now. I know. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I don't even know what to do with it. I know. We're getting ridiculous now in these spells. I'm just gonna so polymorph good. into a tiny woodland creature every session. <laughs> <laughs> I got I have been doing that for like seven levels. <laughs> <laughs> I was like super jealous, so I wanted to crush it too. <laughs> I actually have conjure woodland creatures now. Hey. Mm. So we can have all the woodland creatures. We can have an entire petting zoo. We're going on like full snow white here. Yeah. <laughs> la la la. <laughs> <laughs> Do my laundry, squirrels. Yes. I actually didn't okay. get anything of particular value this time. Or was it enchanted? Uh, well, you get the aura, don't you? At 7th? And 6th. Like, you have two auras now. Oh, Oath of the Crown 7. I'm sorry. When it cre- yep. Oh, yeah, I do. I do. Yeah. <laughs> this is uh, this is the part of the game where we discovered just how selfless Wall really is. <laughs> 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 yeah. Because if he ever uses this, so that means that we we um, wall is now the center of our party, and we should be <laughs> ten feet ten feet away from wall at all times. Right, right. <laughs> I'm not. Like, I'm not taking everybody's HP. <laughs> well, we're just all hiding behind big old shield, daddy. Well, <laughs> you, shield, daddy. You, yes. <laughs> You have you have the aura of protection, which grants us your charisma added to our um, any of our saving throws. So that's always really great. Yes, Ooh, I actually yeah. had that before. I know from six level, and I was like, and I didn't see it until until <laughs> the end of the session. <laughs> I'm like, oh, you'd have felt really bad if one of us died. Yeah. <laughs> well, I actually I forgot that uh, Daniel blessed us. That's nice. Mm-hmm. So I was going. So did Danielle. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I, yeah. We didn't. I didn't even remember that. <laughs> I, I think gaming at midnight just is like <laughs> you are going to screw up. I think that's yeah. sort of our deal now. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I don't know what I get forgotten. Pretty much. All right. So on the note of that. <laughs> yeah. Hey, let's. You want to wrangle some cats? Yeah. Right? <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, I used to have this rule that I wouldn't level PCs until I was confident that the players understood and had used all of their abilities. So, <laughs> no, be at level two. We don't want to do that. Yeah. <laughs> what was that? The last time you understood all your abilities was level two. <laughs> no, Pretty that much. was the last time I could keep track of them. Yeah. <laughs> I yeah, I realized uh, I was editing some of the actual play last week, and I realized I really need to go over my notes because I've completely forgotten what I've given who. Oh. <laughs> so in terms of now, items, add I, items, special abilities. I don't remember if if I'd gotten everyone on the same page or if I still owed things to certain people. I really. Oh, because really we did those, those certain vignette, vignettes where we got little yeah. special things, or like our items got bumped up. Yeah, so I can't remember if I've done that for everybody yet or not, so I'll figure that out. <laughs> I, do, I do recall you just granting it and then uh, postponing vignettes for another time, but I, don't quote me on that. Yeah, I got my thing and I did not have a vignette. Yeah. <laughs> oh, okay, cool. So maybe I got mm-hmm. it to I yeah. So. I don't remember if I did or did not or got anything because I don't have a good memory. <laughs> <laughs> did your special item get any new shit? Yeah, cuz that, that I... was I think that was the main thing that you that you did Lex for us was <laughs> add add new things to the items, new spells or just well, think, at least for mine. I think some of you at least got some enhancements to like some of your racial Abilities. Oh, like I, I know Brett did because oh. I just edited his his vignette, <laughs> which is yeah. what reminded me. I'm like, oh yeah. <laughs> I vaguely remember you said something about um my I think it was like my hidden step for bulk ability, my invisibility or something was getting buffed. Yeah, that's but right. don't 
quote me on that. No, yeah, I think you're right. I think I did do something with your um, invisibility thing. Quick, let's yeah. listen to the last five episodes. <laughs> <laughs> well, it should no, be on was, your I think it wasn't my vignette. Was yet. <laughs> I, I completely forgot, and I think it wasn't my vignette. Human? I, I would hope <laughs> anything relevant to your character would be on your sheet. Yeah. <laughs> um, or you gave us racial feats from um, from Xanathar. I yeah, I did different things for different people. Like, I know Brett, like, I improved his flying thing. Right. And yeah, I think one or two of you I gave feats because I just couldn't come up with anything to do. I think maybe I did that with Craig because he was a human. I'm like, here, just have a feat. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> yeah well that was it like you get to be more human yeah <laughs> more human lean than into human. it yeah. what do you do it's Monday. like the rob zombie song says that's right yeah more oh, human you just wake up with a little more acne oh my gosh yes. <laughs> In his puberty, in his <laughs> old age. <laughs> oh i found I a think couple I found more parking tickets i don't know <laughs> Now, I don't know if mm. these are things I've already given you or I'm, I was going to give you. Um, so, wall, let's see. Um, the, the Radiant Soul. I already have that. Oh, is that a, is, does that riff off of what he already has? Well, yeah, it's an improvement. So what I did is I took your racial abilities that you already have and I improved them. Oh, okay. So, so now... my radiant soul is updated on my spread on my sheet. Okay. So radiant or soul. It's more radiant. So now it lasts for a minute. And yes. you have a fly speed of fifty. Yes. Okay. So that one we for sure did. Uh Bryn's hidden step. <laughs> yeah, um... I don't think you ever gave me the specifics on that because I never I don't have it. Hidden step. Once per short rest is bonus. I turn invisible up to one minute. Yeah, no, that's the same as it was. The vanilla hidden step, so. Hmm. I think, you know, I know I remember you said you were going to buff it. I don't know if you gave me the. Yeah, let me, the, I, I gotta um, find what's in the book. I could have just forgotten to write it down. I don't know if this is what's in the book or if this is the improved the improved one hmm. here i got furbolgs right here yeah so what's it say for a hidden step for furbolg um as a bonus action you can magically turn invisible until the start of your next turn or until you attack make a damage roll or force someone to make a saving oh. throw so yeah. i did so he increased it to a minute yeah because yeah. it's a minute now okay instead sweet instead of your next turn and then All when right. you use it, you can't use it again until a short or long rest. Is that the same? Yep. Wait, uh, hold on. Uh, da, da, da. As per the invisibility spell. That's all it says. So. I assume so. Yeah, it sounds like I... I... I think I probably gave it to you, all you guys, but it's probably good to go over it. Yeah, I just found mine too. I, I didn't realize I had not added it to my character sheet, so it is now. Because I might have increased that, um, how often you recharge it, maybe. Um, it might have just been a long rest before. Mm. Oh no, shorter long rest. Okay. So yeah, that's the, I think that's the only thing I changed with that is it lasts for a minute now. Um, and then speech of beast and leaf. You, I think you did say like, hey, you can just kind of speak better. To you them. have more words to your vocabulary. Or you can kind of understand them. I've taken beast and leaf one. Now I'm taking beast and leaf two, high school yep. level. <laughs> You're doing the 400 classes now. Okay, yeah. So, <laughs> so the way it was originally was you could just understand them, but they couldn't understand you. Yeah. Um, or no, they the other way around. They could understand you, but you couldn't understand them. Um, so now, 
uh, you get kind of a limited understanding. Um, yeah, and I, then, then you, I have advantage on charisma attacks to influence them. Yeah, that that that's always been there, but but uh, now yeah. you can make an insight check to try to understand them. Okay, so you might want to add that. I'll do that. Um, Larissa, you got the infernal constitution feat, I believe. We did. Does that the, sound right? Yeah. Yes. Which gives you resistance to cold and poison and advantage on poison saves. Yep. Very nice. Very nice. And I was, was, yeah. Fear, let's see. Mine is, uh, lets me cast Scorching Ray using my constitution uh, yeah. as a fire genasi. <clears throat> cool. Yep. Cool. And yep. then Quincy got to choose a feat. Do you remember what you chose, Quincy? <laughs> nope. You, you uh, are allowed to either choose Dungeon, Delver, Prodigy, uh, or another feat, or an ability increase. Wait, I could choose Dungeon, Delver, Prodigy, another feat? Yeah, or some other feat. Or some other... Oh, okay. So basically... I'm okay, glad man. that you wrote down the two and then just said, or anything else. Well, well, those were those <laughs> two are specifically human feats, like racial. Oh, feats. are they? Yes, Wait, they are. Well, well, just in the book, isn't it? They're in um, one of the, the Xanathar. The Xanathar has yeah, those that's feats a that, one. um, which I can read them to you if you don't have that. Like prodigy uh, and the stuff like that. I think is like half elf and humans and stuff yeah, like that. Yeah. All right, give um, me a second. I'm sure that I can. Take that. And it's like a. Uh... You are a better human <laughs> than you were before. I like being a better human. Do you not human people? I, I have to say, I kind of was knocking their titling of their books before, but now that I have Bolo, Xanathar's, and Morden Canaan's, I have to say these are terrible book titles. Like. I cannot remember <laughs> what is what. Like, which is the one with all the monsters? Which is the one with all the new classes? Like, oh, that one's in uh, Zanaki and Mortithal. That's yeah, <laughs> it's like uh, titles that tell you nothing. Cool, though. <laughs> they sound cool, but tell you nothing about what's in that book. Yeah, no, because it's like Anathar's Guide to Everything. So what's yeah. everything? Yeah, so it should all be in that book, right? That's the only one we need. Yes, <laughs> Book of Holding. Yeah. Uh, oh. So it looks like feats might be in Xanathar's, maybe? Yeah. Yeah, it racial is. feats. It is. Go. Yeah, the Prodigy. racial feats are on Xanathar. Prodigy. Oh, Craig already got it. He beat me to it. Yeah. So, uh, gain one profi skill proficiency, one tool proficiency, fluency in a language, and plus one to an ability score. Bam. Yeah. That, that sounds a very good like night. just awesomely, just generically good. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. Have one of yeah. everything. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that that actually yeah. is just be a slightly better human. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That, that was the idea. Yeah. All right. I will be a prodigy. Okay. Like, I don't know how one becomes a prodigy late in life. But... <laughs> <laughs> the oldest you... prodigy. That's, your... <laughs> that's, that's how you're prodigious. That's, that's the only way sons return. I suppose. <laughs> so, all right. I'm, I don't know. I'll have to think of how that makes sense story-wise. I can't think blah. of it. Well, you know, it could prodigy be, or just be the it, wisdom of old age. It life could experience. be something you've, you've always, an ability you've always had. You just haven't exhibited it yet. I haven't really talked about it that much. No, I've always been able to do this. What are you talking about? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> All right. Um, what are you going to choose? I don't know. Give me a second. It, it's like that episode of Star Trek where suddenly Riker plays the trombone. You know? It's like, right. no, he's <laughs> always played the trombone. We just this hasn't been relevant you. before. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. We've, we're learning new things about our characters every day. I like it. <laughs> if only he could figure out how to properly use the chair. Yeah. Well, you know, you could just neo it and be like, you wake up there like, I know Kung Fu. <laughs> yes. Yeah. I have multi-class wow. into monk. I, uh, I, I don't think I need to multi-class into monk. I definitely <laughs> didn't. He definitely didn't multi-class into 
actor. So, <laughs> ouch. D- does anyone have uh, like so true though any questions about like leveling up or what happened last week or anything like that? No, nope. I mean, no. I didn't remember. <clears throat> this is not so much a question. It's just I didn't remember anything about Edo in the mountains to the east. No, oh, I mean, I remember, I remember, I don't remember a name, but I do remember it mentioning, being mentioned as a potential, um, you know, a potential helper to, but it, but we decided that it was too far for us to travel there. By the time that we got back, she would have collected some, some other soul. And so we decided to go to the Feywild. Yeah. Well, well, Brett's character has more information about Edo. Mm-hmm. From its vignette, so so let's go watch that. <laughs> no, let's play. Yeah, I think you should have a conversation in character and ask him. About it. <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> well, where did we last leave off? Well, okay, as we're in so the mad, it just we <laughs> ran away from it. So it sounds like no one so. has questions about leveling. So, so the yeah. next thing was. Um, you you guys did have a few <laughs> zombies that had been turned and were fleeing, but um, were not destroyed. Um, so my first question is: Is your intent to just kind of let them run away, or or did you want to hunt them down and and dispatch them? In which case, I think we could just kind of hand wave that. Yeah, because yes. they're like Should I will quarter specifically CR zombies. hunt them down and kill the abominations <laughs> okay. of the undead. And and your character is very well suited <laughs> you with your radiant arrows. You could just easily pick them off as they're shambling away. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, yeah, Quince, you wanna I, deal with that? Yeah, I think I'm just gonna have a lot of moments of like, haha, headshot. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> So, so once that's dealt with, I mean, you guys, um, you're you're at what's left of, of this witch's house that's buried under the, well, not really buried under the tree because it was under the tree to begin with. Um, so when the tree fell, like all the roots kind of ripped up and and kind of tore the house to pieces. So it's in ruins. Um, you, you've got uh, you've got Jenkins and uh, Miguel waiting on you uh, in the woods with with the horses. And yeah, I mean, it, it's kind of you guys have some time to decide what you want to do and converse and all that good stuff. I I suggest perhaps we should um, rummage through whatever is left of her um, her hut and hastily make our way back to the village. I'm not sure where she went and where she disappeared to, but um, we have not seen the last of her. I'm sure. That I'm sure of. What do we do with the psychopath? Mm. Huh. We oh, keep yeah. him with us. Him. No. <laughs> Don't like him. Well, fear. We didn't end up needing him. And you did go to all the trouble to go get him. So, well, how about you decide? You, It's your prisoner now. It's yours. Damn it. I can take him off your hands if you wish. Mm. I, uh, I'm right. intrigued. <laughs> I'm so, what, what would you do with this white elephant prisoner? <laughs> I don't know. We'll leave it up to, up to chance. Perhaps he could be useful to us in other ways than being dead. There is no uh, way he can be useful. We, sh- we should bring him back to the village <laughs> and imprison him, him there. Allow justice to fill its course. Justice would be killing him. Oh. Concur. All right. Good enough. I mean, you <laughs> were sentenced under your laws, right, Wall? So, I mean, you could... This is correct, yes. I don't know. I, I don't really want anything to do with it. I him. abdicate my position and hand it to Wall. It is in your hands, my friend. <laughs> Let he who passes the sentence swing the soul. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, I, say, uh, I say, well, killing him would be a, a, a better mercy than making him atone for what he did. 
Oh, he shall atone for what he did, whether he lives or dies, I'm sure. Mm-hmm. Very well. I, I, I cannot kill an unarmed man, though. Do you want me to take his arms off? I'm... No, he has arms. He has arms? That's yeah. not what... <laughs> <laughs> don't jump I, that worries that me that that's where your head went here. <laughs> it worries me, I'm not gonna lie. I'm sorry. Um, let us... Let us take some time. He's, he's good right where he is with Kravitz. Let us take some time. Do um, you wanna fight him in... Look through... In, I don't, there was ever a place to do. Did they fight each other in be. single combat? Did I they... would not. I would not be opposed to this, but I I took a little bit of a beating myself, so I would I would like a minute to rest my bones. Yeah, I'm not um, feeling so hot can, either. Do you do you need a bit of a moment to uh, to heal? Yes. Should we? <laughs> Should right. we, I mean, it's you what kind of a day is it? <laughs> do you wish to, you know, are, are you so bad that you wish me to call upon uh, Dianara to oh, help you? I forgot our oh. agreement. Yes, I have to raise my hand and say, yes, I'm hurting now. <laughs> <laughs> Too much armor. It's hard. The blood just cooled. <laughs> With the three, it was a lot of blunt force trauma. Uh, it's probably early afternoon. Um, and it took you guys about four hours to get here. So um, if you head back within the next hour or two, you should be able to to get back to the village by by night. Oh. If you don't want to stay All in right, small. we should go then. Shall I we? Mean, um... We could take an hour or so to just catch our breath in, in case, you know, something happens in the way and then head over. Unless we, we want to head over quickly now. How bad are we feeling? Do we feel like we need to catch our breath? I I'm... could use a breath catch. <laughs> I'm pretty That's good. <clears throat> um, right. I think I could too, probably. Are you guys thinking okay. short, rest or... short rest? Yeah, like a short rest. Yeah. Not Nothing like staying here for the night, but no. maybe just a short rest and then head over. Well, do you want to go through her stuff first? Yes. Yeah. Yes, she See could have can... healing potions or something. Well, healing potions probably. at this point will probably be uh, cr Saved. crushed. Hmm. Well, you never know. You never know. So, I asked Fear if she can, if she needs any assistance with the looking. Oh, are we looking? I shall look. Yeah. Or I ask will. you to help look, or anyone else who would like to look around. I will cast around. guidance on you so you can look better. We're investigating? Yeah. yeah. Let me get out my dice. So does her... Oh, she's giving me guidance, which does what? It's an extra d4 to your roll. Okay. Uh, I, can, I can use the help action and help you. And that gives me advantage? Yeah. Doodly do. Just pat her shoulder and see. Silly cat. And a D4. Mm -hmm. See with the eyes of the eagles or something. This is inspirational, right? You can do that. <laughs> <laughs> the inspiration went off a cliff near the end. Uh, though, 19. <laughs> it was a good try, though. Charisma of zero. <laughs> that was 19, Lex. Okay, yeah, you find some stuff. Stuff! I've got the party bag out, uh, or handy. Like a Kirby, just... <laughs> <laughs> Ready to suck everything into it. You find a quite heavy, uh, small, wooden, locked chest, uh, kind of buried under a rock that seemed to be originally part of the foundation of, of this hut. Okay. I think we uh, uprooted the tree. So good we have no rogue. Excellent. <laughs> well, anyone else? Dexter? I can be a prodigy. Bards, rogue. Bards can be. Yeah, I can. I, I like pull out a bobby pin. Maybe I don't know. I can try to. Hey. Okay. Heavy, heavy, small wooden locked chest. Mm -hmm. 
Um, you also find a uh, what looks to be a uh, what do you call it? A scroll scroll case, scroll tube. Uh, it seems Ooh. to be made at, uh, out of a single bone, some kind of large animal. You're not sure what. Um, with very uh, disturbing looking glyphs carved into it. And let's see. You find a lot of other like <laughs> debris, basically, at this point. <laughs> Lots of broken um, pottery and glass. And um, it looks like there is quite a bit of like alchemical equipment in this place that, that is mostly ruined. Um, but you do find a. Actually, let me look and see what this thing looks like before I say too much. What is it again? Hmm. I came up with this stuff so long ago. It's like <laughs> someone else wrote. <laughs> so long. In one of my games, I just finished a storyline that I had wrote over three years ago. It was yeah. ridiculous. Yeah. I had laid hints and they just never bothered to do it. it it took three years for them to figure out how to do it. It took very long. You, you find what, what is a very finely made uh, helmet. Like like what someone in plate armor would wear. Mm. Uh, but as you kind of look it over, you're, you're pretty sure it's enchanted in some way. It's, There's Lotus's mm. name all over it. That, that <laughs> gems uh, and, and intricate work. Yes, I'll do some hand waving, but I need time, so we should just put it in the bag of holding for now. We can do that at home. Yes, we do that. Do we want to put the heavy thing in the bag of holding too until we find somebody who knows how to use lock smithing Yes, unless tools? Larissa thinks she can do it. Well, I mean, I can give it a try. Do you have uh, these tools? No, I mean it'll be probably really, uh, really hard. <laughs> but <laughs> um, do we maybe just want to wait? Yeah, until somebody does. I bet your, I bet your half man friend in, in the village. <laughs> I say, I'm like okay. holding my bobby pin. Are you questioning my skills? <laughs> I'm questioning your statement. I'm saying I have no skills, and but I can give it a try. <laughs> <laughs> That sentence didn't fill me with too much inspiration. <laughs> <laughs> Do bobby, bobby pins count as lockpicks, Lex? Uh, well, <laughs> it, it would let you try, but you would be at disadvantage. Cause it, yeah. It is a tool. It's not the right tool. <laughs> it's better than nothing. Yeah. Well, I'll give it a try. Okay. All right. Go ahead and... I will cast a, guidance uh, on her uh, as well. Can I... Uh, can two unskilled people help Make each other? Make a skill? Other? No. <laughs> you have to be skilled to help. So, so okay. I got a 10 and an 11. And ten. I get a oh. D4. D4. And that's a 3. So 13. Okay. And another 3 from my dex. No, you don't add proficiency. It's only 2. Sorry. Tr jack of all trades. Right, oh. so I uh -huh. I can oh. add half of my proficiency bonus, round it down, so that's one, yeah, plus three <laughs> total with my dexterity, so sixteen. Okay, uh, you you managed to get it open, and with nice. like, you, wow. you see gleaming uh, coins and gems. I'm like, ha! <laughs> I tip my hat to you, ma'am. I didn't think you had it in you. <laughs> Never doubt Larissa. Never, Never. doubt those hairpins. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, yeah, so I, uh, there are gems in here. Yes, and gems coins. and coins. All right. I give it to Fear to count our accountant. <laughs> um, do you, are you just going to send the count later or something? Um, yeah, I mean, if you're going to count it, I can put it in the chat or something. Yeah, I've got the um, 
the sheets open to keep track of it. Oh, and I, I missed something else. You also found another wooden box. Uh, this one isn't locked. And when you open it, there's a bunch of sawdust in it. And amidst the sawdust, you find two uh, vials that look to be potions of some kind. Ooh. All right. So the monetary can, stuff, I'll just start putting in the chat, I guess. Can I use a... Uh, like, how can one identify what a potion is? Well, I could do, like, identify, but I was wondering if I could just do, like, an arcana check to see if I recognize them by sight. Um, you can actually just taste them. What? It's yeah, easy. yeah no you way. can, like, you can, like, gum them uh -uh. And, see, and see what they are. That sounds yeah. like a terrible idea, Lex. <laughs> That's what <laughs> it says in the book. Yeah, <laughs> That's book how you identify you. a potion. You just take yeah. it like taste. me. Take all right. Place. It's iodine yeah. powder. I'm like, <laughs> all right. And I'm just <laughs> this tastes like drywall. Does your extensive knowledge of alchemical techniques tell you what that is, Larissa? <laughs> <laughs> well, <laughs> so I'm just it's like, so with the lock. <laughs> she can do anything. <laughs> Well, I lied. There are three work? potions. I can't count. So. <laughs> it didn't help if I put things in order on my thing. Um, so, did you see the yes, treasure? The treasure. Them to the to the list. Oh, when yeah. we get back to town, somebody remind me that I need to see a jeweler about three hundred gold pieces worth of diamond. For no reason. <laughs> <laughs> I just played a cleric. I know what that's all about. <laughs> yeah. I'm yeah, also uh, willing to say take goodbye to ever have money show. again, Craig. That's all I can say. Yeah. You will be um, forever. If broken. people wish to donate to the insurance policy of <laughs> he who dies first gets revivified. I will um, donate because you helped donate <laughs> to my potion making endeavors. So you, you uh -huh. can count on me. Excellent. I will donate because Bryn does not understand money. <laughs> yeah, we need to we need to start paying insurance <laughs> in di in diamonds. Yeah. I, I guess for anyone uh, who's listening, uh, they found nine hundred copper pieces, five thousand silver pieces, four thousand eight hundred seven gold pieces, one hundred thirty platinum pieces, eleven bloodstones worth fifty gold each, and six black onyx worth fifty gold each. This witch was rich. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> All right. This I think I can just like... afford the diamond. Now. <laughs> <laughs> like, uh, I'm still taking an insurance policy, uh, but I'm thinking we might want to buy more than one. Lex, is, Lex looks at the bottom of the list. Oh, there's a diamond worth 400 and <laughs> whatever you call it. Oh, I'm, not, I'm not wasting a 400 <laughs> gold diamond. <laughs> that sounds so Quincy. Like, I've got a 400 gold diamond, but I'm not using it for this. So. <laughs> I, I think it says somewhere in the DMG, never give the players diamonds. I'm not sure if that's <laughs> related or... I mean, like, actually, it's worth 299. Yeah, yeah. Quite good and 97. Slightly flawed. Yeah. 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 <laughs> It was worth so, 300, but but you uh, defaced it, getting it out of the, out of the record. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right. Um, so uh, you guys do all that. We're going to take a quick short rest, I assume. I am, yeah. Can. Yeah. Do you want to uh, sing us a song or anything, my friend? Sing us a song, you're a piano man. <laughs> Sing us a song tonight. Let's see. The song of rest, if you are spending hit dies, you will gain an additional two mm -hmm. hit points. Yay. I, I if didn't you get care at all. Right? If you care at all for um for the song. If you don't like the song, F you. <laughs> yeah, if you don't like the song, then uh, <laughs> for yourself. Then. So, uh, All right. Where so, are so. my deep needs? That is a six plus four plus two. 
Was there anything else anyone wanted to do uh, at the witch's place before you guys head back to the village? I, I was, I was yeah. considering that this might be a good place to uh, kill our rabid beast of a murderer simply because he's it is already desecrated ground adding more blood to that probably doesn't make it more desecrated. I'm not sure I want to take him back to the village yeah I don't think I do either also we have to we have to be aware of the fact that we're going to have to explain that <laughs> explain what happened to the deal with Dianara's rest um, yes. well we've... we saw yeah. the witch problem in our no, did we no. though? She's just gone. I mean, she's she. I'm pretty sure back. she plane shifted. She, she can come back, and back. she can come back with her sister. Right. Okay. Fine. So. I really um, thought we were just gonna so kill her, but. Yeah. Well, that was the plan. Yeah, it was. It was a good plan. Um. <laughs> so all right uh, we have to we have to figure out what we're going to tell the the mayors when we get there well we've got a bit of a walk i'm sure we can figure that one out <laughs> um i mean so, i don't know what they were expecting i just feel like negotiating with evil fake creatures doesn't always work doesn't ever work negotiating with the fake creatures in my limited experience has been dodgy I mean, and, like, witches are evil, right? We can well, say witches even, are evil. Yeah, it would be agreed. it would be hypocritical of us to say dealing with the fae is evil. I was not to bring that up. I but... mean, I wasn't saying the fae <laughs> were evil. I was just saying evil. it was dodgy. There yeah. you, Quincy's the one that brought since that one did, up. Since we did make a deal with um, Anna... I can't yeah. say for sure we made a deal yet. And I don't I don't know if we came the right end of that deal. <laughs> <laughs> we shall see. Yes. I'm just I'm saying, not confident in it to say that we won that negotiation. <laughs> well, I'm just saying witches are evil that. and you know, maybe don't negotiate with terrorists. Should we find a way to track her down to where she went? I mean I have no way of knowing. Yeah, I have no head. I, I, I'm gonna just, you know, look over to Larissa. And my limited you... knowledge of magic. Oh, or uh, fear? Perhaps. I, 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 you know, it lacks is there some way that I can know. I mean, I don't know the spell or anything Does like that yet. Or maybe spell? between fear and I can. The way that the witch disappeared? Is that what we're talking I about? Mean, I can you track her? I rolled last time. To, it was not uh, a spell. I tried to counter spell. It was not a spell. So it was I an innate was... ability? Right. That's Correct. That's one... Why I think she might have been fey? Uh, maybe it wouldn't be out of the realm of, the po of possibility that she would be fey. But... Don't we have a fey friend here? Dahlia? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you, you, can to... come, you can come out of the hat now. You've been awful silent. <laughs> bit out of character. <laughs> wow, that was some shame. <laughs> I was just trying to not draw attention to myself. Well, that's a first. She was very uh, scary. She said, yes. uh, uh, Was uh, she. Uh, uh, I think she was uh, fey or human. Did you get a feel of her? I, I think she may have been fey long ago, but I don't think she is anymore. Mm. Well, do you know what she is now? Stop being fey. I don't know. Probably, I don't know. Something might warp you if you spend enough time in certain places. Like maybe she's corrupted? Yeah. I mean, this place seems pretty corrupted. Uh, it's making me kind of sick to just be here, to be totally honest. Yeah, is there any way we can fix this? I mean, it just um, makes me sad. Given time, there are ways in time. Nothing, nothing right now, though. <sighs> we could perhaps, uh, perhaps you, uh, you can commune with one of your nature deities, and they can help. Uh, oh, I can pray at the temple back in, uh, back in the village. We can back pray here, maybe. Well, although we I don't know, maybe 
the reception might not be so good. Yeah, I, I feel a little disconnected. More than I'd like to be, at least. You know, some time away from this place will probably make us feel a little better. Indeed. Well, in that case, let's get to Stefan. <laughs> All right, with, so, with so you guys grab yeah. your loot and, and head back to... I am going to... Uh, I'm going to take Miguel, put him next to uh, where the witch's hut is, and... Uh, how does one uh, murder a defenseless person <laughs> or execute somebody? Do execute. I need to roll for that? We are not murderers. We are yes. ex execute. executors. Right. Execution. Quincy, why don't you leave this to Wall? I've right. killed many a rabid beast in my day. This is no different. <laughs> Look, he hasn't shown any signs of remorse. I don't know. It, uh, he hasn't shown us any any uh, disrespect in the time that we've had him, so... We've had him tied and gagged. <laughs> exactly, we haven't given him any chances. He had his chance in Alondria. He was convicted. Dahlia? Yes? What do you think of our friend here tied up? Uh, I don't like him very much. Why not? I don't know. He, he seems like a bad person. Hmm. It's just a general vibe. He has a sickness in him. Can the sickness be healed? I, I don't know. Perhaps he should see a medic. I look mm. at you, Quincy. You got my skill set. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Quincy the psych, Quincy the therapist. Not, I don't see it. I don't see it. <laughs> Oh, no, Quincy practices up. the therapy of tough love. Yeah. <laughs> Get over it. Next. <laughs> you know, back in my day, we didn't have therapy. We manned up. <laughs> <laughs> Walk it off. I don't think that really works, but... <laughs> no. <laughs> no. I can address okay. that personally. It does not. <laughs> fair enough. Fair enough. Well, we'll move on. Um... Are we going to take care of him here? I see his usefulness is at an end. I don't his want him. His sentence has been given. I, at this point, he's just making a horse slightly tired. Yes, and he is he is dangerous to the to the village if he gets loose. Of course. All right. Any objections? This, I is, this should be a, this should be a no say. unanimous uh, decision. We can always turn him over to the guard. Let them do with him what they wish. Yes. They're That's already nice. tired. They're I worried. We they're need more worried them. about the things coming into the village. They don't need to worry about what's already there. Yeah. I agree. But uh, we are not the law. At least I am not the law. So I, if there's no law out here but us. He was given to me to face execution. There is nothing wrong with delivering his sentence. <clears throat> That's 3-4. I... Honestly, I don't understand human laws or human customs. This is not my struggle. This is not my disagreement. I didn't want anything to do with him in the first place and I hold that position now. You humans do what you will with your own. Yep, that's I I'm playing the furball card. Just don't don't get me involved. Abstained. Very good. <laughs> <laughs> and Larissa. I I vote for not killing him. All right. All right. Say we and don't kill him. What do you recommend? Making him pay, repay, or do something not being dead. I don't think that he serves any purpose being dead. How does he pay for the lives he took? How does he pay for the pain that he inflicted? He can be in service to the village. Do you think he would willingly do this? 
Well, we do you think taking... we would be able to trust him when he says he is willing to do it? Well, we should allow him to the the choice. Is Miguel here right now? Yeah, I was just no. Yeah. He... I think I think no. he was away with uh, the horses, and then he, he is left. With, he was, yeah, with, he was he's with Jacob. Yeah, I, I, this is a, a question from Phoebe to Lex. Is 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 he standing here with well, us? That depends on or... where you guys are having this conversation. And, and we were by the hut. Yeah. 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 And I think we left him and the other guy and the horse, like, away somewhere. Yeah, they're in the woods. Off of the Leroy. way. Yeah. No, Jenkins. The most Leroy's in town. Oh, oh right. Jenkins. Jenkins. Sorry. Sorry. Yeah. The most memorable of NPCs. Man. <laughs> <laughs> um, well, I think that this decision needs to be unanimous as a, as a group. And uh, therefore... We can discuss this with the law back in Alondria. Are there are there magical ways of say seeing if he is deceiving us? Sure. Other than knowing it, yes. Yeah. Just didn't. reading him and knowing that he's telling the truth. Perhaps if well, we give him the word and allow him to, you know, say his piece and judge from I, that. I have one spell left. I could I could still cast. Zone of truth, uh, but that does not mean he has to answer. No, no, I think he we doesn't. have ways of making him answer. <laughs> Alternately, have you guys considered the Furbog way? Setting him into the forest, yeah, pretty much. I mean, that's what we do with murderers <laughs> and you know, people who you know break our taboos. We just banishment. Send him off into the forest. If he dies out there, he dies. If he survives out there, he survives. If he survives, he can be a problem later. I agree. That risk seems high. I have an idea, Dahlia. Says. Oh? Yes, Dahlia. Okay. You could give him to the queen. Oh. Mm. Um, why would mm. she want him? Oh, she has all manner of uh, Human Slaves. Yes. Toys. Yes. I, I didn't want to say it so crudely, but yes. Wait. He has many slaves. Um, that, that might actually be useful. He, he might be... Uh -huh. he, he might... Uh, maybe you could use him as, as a gift. Mm-hmm. All but, right. Uh, here's maybe one something human to help get her off of our backs. The other humans alone? Well... Oh. If he has any use at all, we should le let him fulfill some value. I agree, I agree. with Larissa. I just mm -hmm. I could see no value in this cre in this person. So what if we well, asked I him? He can carry rocks. He mm. can carry. Well, <laughs> I like this idea. Thing. Yeah. He can he can serve physical labor for as long as whatever whoever deems it fit. But. As long as he's not right. in the village. All in right. that case, mm -hmm. let's bring him back, and we can figure it out on the way. So then we have to tell the mayors <laughs> why we still have the prisoner with us. Uh, well, the witch problem didn't need a sacrifice. Mm. Yeah, this is true. the witch problem hasn't really gone away. If anything, it, it might it went away. be worse. I said it no longer required a <laughs> well, I But do, it could. I do uh, feel I, I do feel that of the you know, the village might be somewhat protected uh, regardless of what because of Anna and her presence there. I'm sure she wouldn't allow mm -hmm. The, her to just waltz in there and, you know, retake or reclaim the village. And again, if she was Faye at some point, that, I don't know if that means that she is easier I, access or maybe more difficult. I, I don't I, know. The wall glances down at his, at the hilt of his sword and he says, I, I don't think she was Faye. Okay. I think she was more along the lines of Fiend. Fair. Hmm. Well, if she's fiend, I don't particularly want to go chasing after her. 
I would rather she come back to us. I just don't know what she's going to come back to us with. Well, wait a minute. It has to be less than what she has there. Hmm. If she's a fiend. Mm -hmm. Well, I don't really know a lot about demons and stuff, but like the things coming from the north. Are those fiends? Mm -hmm. Those are demons and fiends, yes. Yes. So along the same line. If she's a fiend, couldn't she maybe be connected to them? And this is a big conspiracy. I was going to recommend that the demons be the next thing that we turn our attention to anyways. I wholeheartedly agree. In that case, let's get back to the village. Alright. <laughs> this place is outlived this and useful. This is a good plan. Alright. Back to the village we go. Miguel, I'll get leave. back off your ass. <laughs> Pull them off. <laughs> While you guys I... have been uh, discussing all this, uh, Dahlia got bored. Oh, no. And oh, no. started rummaging through through the wreckage, um, looking for shinies. And um, a couple of times you, you heard her exclaim as she found some little bobble or, or something. And all of a sudden, you hear her gasp. And she says... Oh no, it can't be. It can't be. And she like flies over to Larissa and like hides in her hair and starts sobbing. Uh, What's uh, wrong? I I take her out, out of my hair and into my hand. I'm just as what's going on? I don't I don't know what it means. I don't know what, what it means. What is it? I will tentatively walk over to see what she was looking at. I draw my sword. <laughs> Um, you see, uh, Bryn, you see laying on the ground uh, in the mud uh, something shiny and, and metal. And, and when you pick it up, you realize it's a, uh, um, like a like a barrette kind of thing. Like something a woman would wear to, to hold her hair back. And it's shaped like, uh, like a scarab. And it's enameled and very brightly colored and pretty. Um, but just seems to be... It doesn't seem to be anything special, just a piece of jewelry. Not even a very expensive one, kind of cheaply made. Hmm. Did this belong to someone you knew, Dahlia? Yes, yes. When 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 I told you about the story of how I how I got exiled, about about the very nice woman I, I met in the, the woods that, that told me I should give give the queen the the the, the potion for her hair. She she wore she wore something just like that in her hair. <gasps> oh, no. There are plans afoot. Uh, I think... I feel so used! <laughs> I think this witch has many enemies. I think we may have a couple good points to talk to the Fairy Queen now. Agreed. With. Agreed. Agreed. Dahlia, yes. would you be willing to be really brave and helpful and just and maybe see the fairy queen again? Although maybe not right now. Maybe not just a second, but <laughs> to relay what happened. She'll ask questions about you. Yes, maybe we wait until after we take care of the north. Yes. I was just saying, eventually. That seems know. more pressing. One, I don't know, demons wait for little things, and they seem to operate on their own schedule. <laughs> <laughs> um, so, yes. Uh, oh. <clears throat> all right. All right. From here, Miguel walks. Okay, I <laughs> pick up the massive chest of coins, just hoist it over my shoulder. Okay, all right, let's go. Um, we have a bag of oh. holding, my friend. Oh, of course. <laughs> I mean, if 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 it if it's like weightlifting, I'm not into those strong people things. If that's good for you, then you oh, go ahead. But I, I mean, this also... isn't heavy. I mean, look. Woo. Oh, you are mighty. You are so mighty. <laughs> Maybe don't throw the money around? No. <laughs> yeah, I'll take it, take off a couple of 
right. Oh, I don't know. I just assumed because there were so many of them that, that I mean, you I don't really know how don't much these are worth. I... Money, huh? <laughs> yeah, generally, the shinier, the more valuable it is. <laughs> so the silver ones are the most valuable. Well, no, because we'll the just platinum put these ones in the are bag shinier. of holding. Okay. They're bigger. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I mean, I just. I never really had the chance to use any. Yeah. I worked so for room and board. I... For, for, blogs, for blog society is like a pure barter system? Mostly. No. No currency? I mean, there's no real reason to. Okay. Interesting. <clears throat> I mean, how I don't. Do you, how would you trade with? As uh, I'm going to have this conversation as we maneuver our way back to a village. I was just I about to say. Yes. <laughs> Anthropologist <laughs> is interested. Yes. <laughs> I, I climb atop Kravitz and I I move ahead of the group just a little bit. Okay. So yes. 